Janelle Evans faced backlash on social media after sharing a video of her eldest son, Jace, participating in a spicy noodle TikTok challenge on Sunday, February 18, shortly after the teenager returned home following being taken into CPS care. The Teen Mom star filmed her kids, Jace, 14, Kaiser, 9, and Ensley, 7, trying a series of Pool Doc Instant Ramen flavors. Although the mom and siblings appeared to be having a great time trying to scarf down the spice-filled meal the decision to feature Jace in the video sparked mixed reactions. One user praised Janelle, telling her, good job, mama, everything is going to be okay, while several others offered up prayers for Jace after spending several months living away from his mother, brother and sister. However, others criticized the mom of three for allegedly exploiting the 14-year-old for her social media content. Janelle, your son needs help and support. Keep him off social media. One follower said, and another added, I thought her biggest concern was Jace's mental health. Sharing him all over social media is not the way to be concerned about his mental health. I wish she would stop posting Jace. He's obviously having issues and her focus should be on creating a supportive environment to help him, another pointed out, and a fourth asked, hasn't he been through enough? A separate user noted, I don't know how she doesn't get it. She isn't posting him because she cares so much, she posts him so she can say, see, I'm a good mom and I'll show you. As OK previously reported, Jace was removed from his home by CPS after several runaway attempts and claims that he had been physically abused by his stepfather, David Eason. The 35-year-old was initially charged with a misdemeanor, but it was later bumped up to a felony. The defendant unlawfully and willingly did, being the parent of Jace V. Evans, who was a child, less than 16 years of age, inflict physical injury on that child, the court filing read at the time. The physical injury inflicted caused marks on their right arm and left and right side of the neck and was inflicted by other than accidental means. While David is still facing the child abuse charge, Janelle confirmed on Thursday, February 15th, that all allegations against me and my husband have been officially dropped concerning the CPS investigation. I'd appreciate if everyone respects my son's privacy so he can get his mental health in check, she said in the video. The Sun reported the sum of the social media comments, 